Hi, I'm David Stringer with Insignia. Welcome back to the Diplomat Challenge. The Diplomat Challenge is all about transforming my car to reflect the creativity and passion of our industry, all the while introducing you to some cool people behind the scenes. Previously on the Diplomat Challenge, we collaborated with Adams Polishes and Catskin Leather to give the Diplomat a luxury feel. Adam's team at Adam's Polishes gave the Diplomat a much needed cleaning and protective coating. Ron Leslie, National Sales Manager at Catskin, and Sean Collins of Auto Toys did a fantastic job transforming the interior of the Diplomat with this lavish Tuscany Catskin leather. And my favorite part is... Oh no, my wheel! Ashes to ashes, dust to dust. That's why wheel protection is a must. Why didn't I get wheel protection? Our condolences. Thank you. Today, we are partnering with Alloy Gator, a worldwide leader in wheel protection. Alloy Gator has developed a dependable, cost-effective, and durable alloy wheel protection system, which vastly reduces the risk of wheel damage. Alloy Gator offers more than just protection. Its custom colors allow your customer to add their own flair during the vehicle personalization process. All right, Patrick, we've got the wheel, we've got the Alloy Gator. Let's, uh, let's install this bad boy. Whoa, 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 David. This is not just a clip-on or stick-on product. Although the installation is fairly straightforward, we don't have the right tools here, and it should be done by a wheel and tire professional. All right, well, let's go up to State Line Chrysler Dodge Jeep and see if they can help us. Awesome, sounds great. All right, so tell me a little bit about Alloy Gator. Where did it come from, and you know what's the, what's the history of the company? Well, I'm gonna start with you buy protection for your cell phone. Why not your expensive wheels? Alloy Gator is uh, designed and engineered in the UK. Super tough nylon. It's an accessory with an added benefit of protecting your wheels against minor curb rash. So it seems to me that it would make a great uh, lead-in product. We, we talk a lot in our consulting uh, for dealerships about lead-in products. Uh, so what, what is your thought on it being sort of a first product for vehicle personalization, a first offering of a product for vehicle personalization? It's a great product for vehicle personalization because of it also has the added benefit of uh, protecting your wheel against minor curb rash, but it can be sold on its own as a personalization piece. It can also be sold um, and combined with whatever wheel and tire program a dealer currently has going on. Yeah, it's what's awesome about it and why it is it it's also works in every department is you can cover up minor curb rash and you can do it very discreetly with a color that matches the rim or matches the tire uh, so you cannot really see it and uh, you can make it pop match your calipers match the body color of the car or trim on the car right and we're not talking about a huge expensive item i mean it's not that it's you know a cheap item it's just that it's not a a giant investment. Do you find that most Highline stores gravitate to this product or are you finding that stores that are selling the domestics and some of the imports, um, some of your mid-level, you know, uh, Camrys and Malibus, I mean, they're... Do it's you, across the board. Across um, the board. Everybody puts it on for the same, it's one of two reasons. They want to make it pop. Mm -hmm. They want the color, which I would suggest to you that 80% uh, well, maybe not that high, but let's, let's say between 60 and 80% of the people, why they're attracted to the product is the coloring. Yeah. Um, but absolutely, uh, in the aftermarket world, when they're selling, putting on wheels and tires, and car dealers are selling uh, wheel and tire packages, the protection side uh, fits in very nicely. All right, so here we are. We are pulling into State Line, where we are going to upfit our alloy gators onto the Diplomat. This is State Line Chrysler Dodge Jeep Ram in Fort Mill, South Carolina. They've been an Insignia customer for five years and earned over 300,000 in accessory sales in 2018.
she's gonna set me free. Most people say. Here with Paul Allred at Stateline Automotive. Uh, you'll, if you'll remember, Paul was part of our Diplomat Ride series uh, where he gave us some great advice about selling accessories and uh, not breeding alligators. So my, my deal is, I'll sell anything, but don't breed a damn alligator. And what I mean by that is heat, man. It's, it's, it's doing something up front that you know is going to bite you right square in the butt. It, yeah. be, being facetious and out in left field, you know, if somebody come in and says, "I'll buy that new Ram truck, but I want a I want a hot tub mounted in the back of it," right? <laughs> sure. I think technically you could probably figure out how to do that, but is that what you really want to do? Uh, speaking of alligators, we're here to uh, install some alloy gators. Only these uh, won't bite you on the. <laughs> <laughs> so, Paul, tell us about protective items in a vehicle personalization lineup and what you guys do here to protect vehicles. We do a preload program uh, where we add uh, slush mats to every vehicle. Get kind of kidded by some northern folks that we're south of the Mason-Dixon line, and we put slush mats in every vehicle. But it does rain down here, and you got mud and such, right? We put a bed liner, or either we do some spray-in liners in trucks. We put wheel locks on every vehicle to protect uh, somebody from stealing the tires and wheels off the thing. Mm -hmm. So that works pretty well. And it does add uh, value to the vehicle to the customer, as well as a profit opportunity for us at the store. So talk me through a little bit of the installation process. It all starts with a fitment gauge, a gauge that goes on between the rim and the tire while the wheel and tire are on the, on the vehicle. So our product fits from 12 to 24 inches. Cut the size and then you re-beat the tire back up and on the vehicle it goes. All right, so the one question I have to ask in The Diplomat is, uh, what was your first car? My first car was an AMC Concorde. <laughs> wait, wait. And I don't tell any, too many people about it because it was orange. Wait, wait, you're from Canada, right? <laughs> yes. Oh, uh, wait, wait, so the AMC, like, uh, Wayne's World and uh, the Bohemian Rhapsody. That's correct. Oh, yes. my God. How many times did you sing that in that car? <laughs> Never sang. We did listen to it, though. <laughs> So one of the things you were talking about was the expense at a dealership. Yeah, great opportunity for car dealers. Making sales and producing sales is one thing and extremely important, uh, but also looking at where you can save uh, legitimately on expenses and, and rental cars or courtesy car expenses are always a bone of contention for everybody in a store. And for a customer, brings their vehicle in for service, and then borrows one of your cars, and then has to feel negative when they bring your car back because somebody does a walk around on it and sees that there's damage on the wheel. Oof, yeah. Uh, you're, you're now into a potential CSI issue. Right. Uh, and, and we feel very strongly that it's a great opportunity to look at a client and say, hey, this one's on us. And instead of a, a dealer having to, to take the vehicle off the road to get the wheel repaired um, so their product's presentable, it's presentable the way it should be. Um, they can get it into the shop and within 30 minutes have it out of the shop with a gator replaced. Tell me about the, um, the certifications that uh, this product has gone through that Alloy Gator has and sort of the distinction it has as a, as a manufactured product. Uh, one of the things we're extremely proud of is there are a lot of imitation products out there, stick on, clip on, glue on, that claim to do what our product does. Our product is the only one in the marketplace that is TUV approved and MIRA certified. Both engineering companies from respective TUV being Germany, uh, MIRA being the UK. Our product is engineered um, and designed and manufactured in the UK. Uh, it is not a product that's produced uh, cheap and 
it's a good quality product and it does exactly what it says it's going to do. Our product was first and foremost designed to protect against minor curb rash and all the colors came in afterwards. <laughs> we got Alloy Gator! Alloy Gator, engineered with teeth. Thank you to Patrick Fletch from Alloy Gator for installing these awesome Alloy Gators on the Diplomat. Thank you to Alloy Gator and to Paul Allred at Stateline Chrysler Dodge Jeep. Thank you to Sammy Eubanks for the use of his song, My Baby's Gone. Check him out at SammyEubanksLive.com. So, if you'd like to add something to The Diplomat, why don't you reach out to us, post something in the comments, tell us what you want to do to The Diplomat, and join The Diplomat Challenge. I'm David Stringer. This has been The Diplomat Challenge. We'll see you on the next episode.